set me up and I'm gonna destroy him for it. Time to square the dead. The very beginning of the movie and the opening shot of the movie, he is still a police officer. And then you cut to him now basically in Staten Island, kind of schlepping around, you know, spying on people who are having extramarital affairs. And but when he when he when he you know gets that call from the mayor, he's really excited and you know optimistic about his opportunities and chances to get back into the city and to, to make a difference again. Here's our guy. Mr. Mayor. You, in my eyes. Hero. Thank you. You ever do any hunting? You should try it. You would be a natural. With Mark, um, he's very regimented. I mean, he is the most dependable person on the planet. So when he shows up, there's no not knowing his lines, not whatever. He's prepared. He's the most prepared person I think I've ever met. He wants that opportunity to remind the mayor of how talented he is and how much he cares. So, yeah, I think there there is that and just the ability to cross that bridge again, you know, to be in the city. It's a little bit more exciting. It's a little bit more new. What the hell has this got to do with you? That's what you do now, Billy. You set up execution. I didn't ask questions. I gave him pictures and I walked away. But, uh, you know, as soon as he starts to, to dig, that's where the mayor makes the mistake, even though you realize that the mayor has another card up his sleeve, that he's got to do something about this, you know? He's not the kind of guy who's just willing to turn the other cheek. I need you to find the son of a bitch who's sleeping with my wife. This is not what you think it is. You ever think why I chose you? Because I own you. Bow